presenting a Soundmaster Memory Rhythm SR88. I bought this new, probably around 1983, and it works. We're on the first of the six 16-step patterns. There are two 12-step patterns as well. A pattern, B pattern, those both belong to uh, number one. A followed by B. And three measures of A followed by one measure of B to give us the four bar fill in. And eight, there's also an eight bar fill in, 16 bar fill in option. Let's listen to the sound. all the way down interesting little chirps that happen this transistor noise that it uses to produce the snare symbol and hi-hat the sound also changes when you adjust the volume uh, I'll turn the, vol the gain on my audio interface down Turn that up to full. There might be some uses for that sort of thing. Try again a different tone. Also turn it down to a low level. hear the internal clock bleeding through there as well. Seems like right in the middle is a reasonable setting. I'll show you how to program this thing. So for set, set it to step 2, we'll be programming step 2. Set it to A. Set the sound to the bass drum, this is for programming. And set to write instead of play. And so let's put in a bass drum on the first and ninth, sixteenth notes of the bar. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And for the, now we do the snare drum. Notice that the downbeat light has come back on to point out that we're back at the beginning of the bar. We we'll go a nice um, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So we've got a snare drum pattern there. I'll put hi hats on the eighth notes and a symbol right at the beginning and erase the symbols on the rest of the bar. Okay, so we should be done programming that. Listen to A. Super. So B, we'll put in some kind of crazy fill. I'm not a drummer, so I don't know how to do a fill. But we'll try with something really daft. fill on the fours. And now we're doing beats just like we were in the early 80s. Isn't that awesome? Special effects. It goes from insanely slow to insanely fast. So there we have it. That's the Soundmaster Memory Rhythm SR88. Now, it runs on six, uh, four uh, AA batteries, so it's a six-volt unit. Uh, you need to keep the batteries in to keep the, uh, the memory. You can take the batteries out for up to three minutes to change them.
three minutes, after three minutes, you'll you'll lose the memory. It has an AC adapter, but apparently that doesn't work to sustain the memory once you take the batteries out. Uh, so you still got a three minute rule for that. Um, turn it off when you're not using it to save the batteries. Uh, and the yeah, well, on this particular unit, since I'm selling it, let's take a quick look at the uh, appearance of the thing. Assuming we've still got focus. Information on the back there. There's a little plastic uh, battery carrier uh, with a clip connector on it, a bit like on a 9-volt battery. Anyway, there we go.